So we're out. Nana's house. Huh? You can see Nana's house. Oh yeah, I guess you can, yeah. Oh no, no, Nana's had to be around that corner because that's Burley Headland there. Can you see the edge of it? Yeah, right. <laughs> um, all right, we'll blast out a little bit further and then we'll get these baits out, okay? See, no need to catch live bait means we don't have to muck around. We can just get straight out there. It'll be better once we get away from this edge. We might stop here and get rigged up, huh? And stay away from all the people for until we're until we're ready to get through. What's that? Sabiki, but we're out in the middle of nowhere, man. Yeah, well, we'll just kill the engine all together for a sec. Ah, that's nice. No, nah, what are you talking about? That's fine. So what we're doing here is we're going to come out and just try and catch a Spanish, basically. We're going to do some trolling. Broad Fox, he's definitely got the taste for uh, the boat that. now and fishing. He's the, He's got the bug, that's for sure. So I suggested maybe possible fishing and he was right on top of it. So he's like, yeah, yeah, wake me out, Dad. So let's do that. But what we're going to try today is I've got a mate. I don't usually spruik products. Here it comes with the sellout stuff. These guys are guys that I've fished with for many, many years in the kayak. And I said, look, give me a couple to try. So what they've done is they've actually spray painted a few with the little nice logo and some rocket kit stuff on it. So I thought that was really cool. And don't anyone say, oh, you're selling out. This is like, like this is like whole production prawns. This, this is like guys that have gone to all this effort to make an amazing product. And I just want to, um, I just want to promote it because they're a small business. They're from the Gold Coast. They're local guys, you know, and they're legends. So hopefully they work. What? No, we don't need liveies. We just need to keep, uh, we need to get trolling. That's what we need to do. So you're right. Let's stop mucking around. Let's try a few of these. Jeez, we're, we're getting ripped down pretty quick, actually. So we better hurry up. Less talking, as many other people have mentioned me do. Oh, jeez. Social media, huh? What a mind bender. But anyway, sorry, I won't mention it again. It was just, uh, it had to be brought up at least in some form because, yeah, it's been a pretty hectic kind of week of just opinions and getting pigeonholed into certain ways of thinking. It's just been crazy. Anyway, let's get this one rigged up. I'm really keen to see how these go because it's one of those things that every kayaker or every dead bait troller not just kayak dead bait troller we might actually get a need to get away here fox um we've always tried to come up with a clever system that kind of made your dead bait like a lure and this bib looks like it's going to do exactly that so i think they may have nailed it and they put the time in they're pretty clever guys so hopefully we can catch a fish on it you do no. so gar garfish are always good to troll because they troll well i probably could have just gone and trolled with um troll with a pilly or a slimy but the garfish is the best in the pack from where i was so we'll do those and i want to cover a bit of ground well the line color the line color changes every 10 meters so if you go for two colors maybe even three yeah, well, you'll see it go slack. Just hold the line down, you'll see the line go slack, and then just pull it back up. Right, that guy fish should troll nicely. Okay, let's see. So, we lift the little sickle up. <laughs> we put him in. Oh, garfish are going to, we're going to need to snap his beak down. How are they still alive? It's not alive. Oh. It's very dead. <laughs> okay, so we ripped the top of his head off a bit. So now we can shove his nose right up in there. We'll push this down. Oh, yeah, right. That really does look. That's like locked in there pretty tight. This hook, I reckon we could just leave loose. And this one, I guess we pin in. It's as simple as that, though, I guess. Put his little squid skirt down the front there. Yeah, right. Okay. I see. Wow. Looks good. And it feels solid. Pull on it a bit. Doesn't. Yeah, it's definitely not going to pull out easy. Alright, so that's one. Let's see how it swims. 
So he's a bit frozen in the centre there. We just need to get him, get him nice and loose. So I reckon. Oh yeah, look, his tail's swimming nice, and definitely straight up and down. Oh, that looks good. And these scars. Oh, that looks really good. No, no. Okay. I see. I see what's going on. You good? I got a very positive feeling about these. We can put some time in. Yeah, let's just quickly move out a bit. Yeah. Somewhere. Well, we're drifting into them, so we just. Yeah. Let's just uh, let's just get away first up here. We'll get the other one rigged up. Second one on. What? Can you see things? Yeah, well, it's a whole stack of bait just up on top there. I can see there's bait. We're coming up to a shallower part of the reef, you see? Alright. Yeah, there's bait all around us. Oh, you got something? Yeah. Yeah, I'll put it in neutral. <laughs> What'd you get? Is that the bait jig? Oh, you got whoa! <laughs> That's the hookup. That's sick. Just one a bit slower. Oh wow! Look, there's bait everywhere under there. Look at that. Far out. Okay, lift them up. Oh wow! No, don't want any higher. Just lift them up. It's too heavy, mate. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, okay, we got four now. Jeez, they're good ones, aren't they? Oh. Alright, we're right on the shallow part now though. Look at that bait. Let's put the jig away because we've got to get uh, off this little section here. I need help putting that on. Yeah, look at them jumping over here. I need help. But they're good baits, mate, so. Can you untangle that? Yep. Is it good I caught those bait? It is? No, it'll be good. And I reckon they might come in handy at some point later on. Well, some sometimes, man, sometimes you can't don't get another chance as well. See, sometimes they just disappear or they just go off the shoe. So it is good that you got them. So Fox, do you want to sit over there and let that one out for me? Yeah. So just flip your bail arm over. We'll start with the green one. We'll get one out and then we'll get the other out. Oh, we, can, we can get them both out. No, no. Tell you when. Pick it over. Okay, we'll just, let's just get them up off the bottom first because we're getting over to another shallow section. Now, you should troll pretty quick, so we'll go maybe about 10 k's an hour. And I reckon we should be on the money. Let's go a little more as well. He's hoping we can get onto some big Spanish. Yeah, you get the first fish, okay, Fox? Yeah. Sure. We're lucky enough to get another one. Uh-oh. Bit of a squall coming over inland. Maybe we should head out there where it's not so uh <laughs> it's not so wet. Uh, yeah. We might as well slowly troll out that way. We're going over a lot of structure. You can see it comes up and down heaps. So there's no reason why we couldn't get a big hit. But we'll get away here. Maybe we'll try and get a little bit further out, away from this rain. Uh, we've trolled around for a bit. We haven't had any luck, but what we'll do is we'll check our baits. Because, uh, cover a bit of ground. You're just winding it back in there? Yeah, no, that works well. Come over here. Yep. Oh geez, yeah, they look great. So yeah, there's nothing wrong with the baits. We just got to find the fish. Do you under him? No, you're already there. Look, yeah, yep, yeah, no, that looks good. Okay, put yours out back in the holder over there. Oh yeah, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh okay, yeah, we'll leave them in there. As long as the others are right. Yeah, that happens. Sometimes the bigger baits like that they. 
they struggle a little. Okay. Quick yours over. Should be good. All right, now we wait. Fish of a lifetime, Foxy. Fish of a lifetime. You literally could be catching a fish of a lifetime soon. Just keep that, just keep that as the, in the front of your mind when you're whinging about how long this is taking. <laughs> hey, you know what? Mum actually packed some food in there if you want to have something to eat. It'll distract you for a while, it'll keep you happy. You sure? Not hungry? <laughs> All right. The fish will still hit the lures even if you're having a snack, you know. They won't know. They won't know that you're not paying attention. In fact, sometimes it helps when they think you're not paying attention. <laughs> ah, you just sit there. <laughs> oh, that was definitely a hit. Let's mark that. Move, 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 move. All right. Damn, we missed it as well. What the? F I hope this guy sees us. Bro, what are you doing? We've got lines out. We've got lines out the back. <laughs> All right, geez, that was a bit hectic with everyone. Like that guy, that first boat pushed us right out of, off our line and pushed us right into the, everyone else's lines. <laughs> so that was a bit unfortunate, but still here but that was a nice hit we got a little hit on this part this side so I wind it in and see what kind of position we're in here pity we didn't quite get the hook up oh look at that took everything but his head oh and look bit the whole stinger off so that was a good that was that's probably a big Spanish mate because look he's taking he's taking the whole back stinger off that's all right that's all right See, maybe we could we could re-jimmy these with uh, some gang hooks as well. So what we'll need to do is get this one in first, and we'll see what, what's going on here. Jeez, that's our big chance. Huh? We'll, we'll, we'll cut a couple more laps, mate. We'll get one. We'll get one. Okay. So what I do have, which I was actually using on the last trip, is I have one of these. It's a rig that's already made up but what it also is is thicker wire so i might try and use this wire i think that's 41 pound wire and this is 50 something i think so might as well try and up the wire just a little bit oh, that's exciting man i'm gonna get this big spanish hopefully could be anything really anything with teeth wahoo spanish these pliers don't Okay. We could just break out another rig, but we'll try and salvage this one rather than using a new one straight up. <laughs> Look at that, it definitely didn't get away with the head though. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Yeah, we could come up with some kind of solution that has a that has a gang hook involved so we don't get that bite off issue again don't like bite offs from wire issues that's one of the reasons why i switched to gang hooks on my other rigs it's pity you didn't hit that top section as well anyway we'll get we'll get this one rigged up and get it back out put these guys on the ice seems as they've passed away in our bait bucket unfortunately Oh, look at that, Fox. Bit of a... Yeah, no, no, I mean on the sounder, not the... <laughs> Why aren't we getting Spanish hits? We only had that one hit, come on. It's definitely things going on. We'll go up here, we'll turn back around, we'll go back to where we got the hit, patrol over it, and then we can park up for a second. This, this current will be ripping faster than you can swim. Okay, so you're gonna really struggle with that. 
unless I find a big school of stuff. But what we can do while we wait is have a livey out. Maybe we'll go from the back. Just let him go for a little walk. Have a walk around. Are you? What do you got, Fox? Just take your time, man, because there's tiny, tiny little hooks. What do you got there? Ah, oh, you got my line as well. Two goat fish. Ah. Oh, no, what have you done here? Two goat fish. Two? Yeah, but you also got my... Put your rod down. Move back, move back, move back. Damn it, we don't want to ruin our livey as well. Sorry. That's all right. Two goat fish, eh? Oh, they're probably gone now. No, they're still there. I can see them. <laughs> definitely still there. Definitely still dead. Yeah. I definitely need to get my livey off there somehow as well. I don't know how. Can I keep one? Hmm? Can I keep one? Goatfish are actually really good eating. Can Let's I keep get one? them in. Here, we'll get them in. Can I keep one? Yeah, we'll keep, we'll keep both. Let's do a goatfish cook up. Are you sure? Because goatfish are really yummy. Are you sure? Yeah, I've got a big problem here though. Uh, yeah, we got to look, we've really tangled this larvae up in a big way. Okay, that's a cracker of a goatfish though, mate. They're actually really good. Me. Perfect grilled. Oh, what's going on? Okay, let's put these, let's get these guys into their bucket and we'll deal with the next issue. Just if everything just takes off all of a sudden, just let it go, okay? Because um, if a big fish grabs that, um, that livey while it's out there, we're going to be in all kinds of problems. So just let it go, man, it's all right. The last thing I want is for you to get like your hands cut by this braid. Get it, folks, get it. No, no, just, just be careful, okay? Just lift it up. You got it? Did he get off? He wanted, wind it up, wind it up. Help, help! There you are, gotcha, gotcha. Just stop winding for a sec, stop winding, I can't tighten the drag. Okay, now, keep winding, wind it up. You hold on to that. Do not let it go. Help, 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 help. Oh, gotcha, help. gotcha. <laughs> Let's get some of this stuff out of the way. Okay, wind, wind, wind. Keep that tension on. Did you see that? They really came over and grabbed oh, it. Help, help, Whatever help, you help. do, no, you just yeah. you put it in your crutch and go nuts. Okay, you just don't, don't let go help, of it. Help, if, you, if you're really sudden, oh, geez, he's really going for it. Help, 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 You got help, it, you got it. Help. <laughs> Stop squealing. Oh, It's all right. Holy just, moly. just hold it, you got it? Yes. You got it? I've got okay. it, I've got it. Yeah, get down low if you need to, that's fine. Help. Okay, let me go. Let me help you for a sec. We might, we might need to put at least some brakes on him. That is so big. That's so big. Might need to just put some brakes on him for a sec. Where's that battery that you had? It is big, whatever it is. I wonder what it is. I'll do a little work. We'll do this as a team effort, okay? We'll get some line back on him quickly. I right oh, don't put it in the water. Uh, Here, I'll change this over. Hang on. We're going to okay, switch okay. over. Yep, thank you. We'll start working this guy back in a bit just so okay. he doesn't go over to those okay. other boats. He's strong in. Yeah. And then we'll oh, switch. We got our dinners. Well, hopefully. It depends on what it is, doesn't it? Probably just a big shark. <laughs> I hope it's not a shark. Didn't look like a shark when it hit. It definitely did some yeah. proper jumps. It was like. Shh, shh, shh. Okay. Get me in. Getting I just... tired. Yeah. Okay, that's okay. you're getting tired. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So. Okay, so he's coming around this. Side. Look, go. Where's the car? Where's this thing? Oh, got off. Damn it. That was our only livey as well. <sighs> Damn, we had him so close, Foxy. Okay. Hey, hey, that's fishing. We'll have another crack. 
That's two hits we've had today, so they are around. Well, we've got to try something, and I don't think sitting stationary here is going to cut it, unfortunately. So we'll get the, uh, the trolling rigs rigged up again, and we will do a bit of trolling. Might as well try and see if we can get uh, that swimming nicely. Huh? Too small to fit his head on. No, he should be alright. He's just got to fit in that. He is pretty big actually, but let's we'll get him nice and loose. We'll see if we can get him soon. Look, no, he's, his face fits in there quite nicely. <laughs> let's see. It is a pretty sort of deeper bait though. That's looking very good. That's got to go on Fox. If we put some time in trolling that around. We'll say we're going to get some. Oh, nice. Swim's great there. We'll just slowly truck around a bit and see if we can find something good. Set the guy out. Start the engine. Oh. You onto something? Look like you were. What do you no? Definitely a bigger up. <laughs> yeah, bring them over. We get the keep them. We yeah, get the keep no, them. they're delicious. Can we actually. keep them? I know it's not a fancy fish, but they're definitely good ones. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be something different. All right, no, I'll, I'll pay that. We're just getting pom fruit after pom fruit. I was like, Fox, don't bother, man. You're just gonna get pom fruits again. No, I'm now we've got these now. nice, I'm nice size goatfish. This spot now. Dude, these are meant to be like I've never actually tried the goatfish, but these are cracker fish. These are really good eating. Can I keep catching them? Dude, well, See, we've I got told you we've got four in total now, I so I reckon we might not even. But I need to keep catching. I don't think we need to catch any more goatfish though. I, 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 I think we've got a we've got a delicious grill up there or something. Watch out! Don't don't stab me. Yeah, that's it. That's an awesome fish. Good size. Beauty. Go the goat, mate. Delicious. I do want to try those. But um, yeah. All right. We'll just let this guy out. I've caught one. Okay, you can catch it too. I don't mind. Let's just give it, wait a sec, is it actually, yeah, okay, it's, it's quite a lot of weight on it though. So oh, help you got me, it? help you got me, it? Yeah, just okay. give me a few. Okay, I'll get these out of the way. Help. Give me. Let's just lay this down. And oh. yeah. You do have a second chance, but... Oh. Okay, let's get this out of the way as well. Did you just dump this, did you? Sorry, Dad. It's alright. Yeah. Yeah, just keep working away at him. No rush this time. No rush. This one's smaller. Is it? We'll just keep working away. Move a bit closer to the back there so the line doesn't touch the boat. There yep. you go. I wonder what it could be. It's alright. Just keep going. You got it, Foxy. You got it. I'll get the gaff out just in case. Just in case it's a keeper. Oh. I don't know what it could be. You alright? Keep working it. Go a bit closer to the edge there, mate. There, stand there. Yeah, so you're not too so close to the edge. See what it is. Keep going, keep pumping around, keep attention on. <laughs> Make sure it doesn't go near the engine, you're going to hit the engine, keep it over that side. Oh, 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 don't let it touch the side of the boat, keep it up. Keep it up, keep it up. Move forward a bit, you're going to have to move this way, so the line's over there. I wonder what it is. Just keep the pressure on, keep working him up, he'll come up. Don't let go. Come on, you can't rest. Why don't you put the, um, can you put that into here, into your stomach? Yeah. Yeah, look there. That's probably better. Okay. 
You got it. Oh, it's in my stomach. Okay. It's a bit long, is it? Oh, it hurts my... You want me to help? Okay, I'll hold it here. There. I'm getting it through my life jacket. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is. You're going to have to keep pumping and winding it. Come on, we've got to get it in. <laughs> oh, here, yeah, what's that? Is that Dewey? What is that? That's a flip. Big spangle. Oh! Yeah, I just keep getting it up. Keep getting Okay, Trey, can you bring it around the side of the boat here? Yeah. Lift that rod it's up a bit. so heavy. Yeah, don't. Yeah, stop, stop, stop. Let's let a little line out. Okay. Now bring it around the side. As a kraken fish, if we can get it in. Oh! No, watch out, Foxy, watch out. Please. I know, please. I don't want to leave him. I'm trying not to lose him, mate. Please. Yes, yes. Whoa. Oh! That is a cracker spangled oh! emperor, mate. Far out. <laughs> well done. Yeah, let some light out, let some light out. <laughs> You're going to have to look at the size. What was a little. Oh, yelch. Wow, bro, that is a monster. Oh, look at that other one. Look at that fish. Whoa. That's a little that? remora. That was what stuck on him. That's how big your spank, you spank got embryos, mate. Your little got a little remora is coming off him. Am I good? Yeah, oh, he's stuck on here. Do you want to let him go or should I just put him in? Oh. Can I keep this person? Yeah, we can eat that. We can we feed the whole tribe with him, mate. Look at that. That's a remora. See how they stick on the sort of How's that a spangled emperor? <laughs> it's caught on one of those eastern pomfrets as well. <laughs> Just dangled out the back. Yeah. Uh, That's a cracker, mate. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> My arm hurts. Yeah, just let some line out and just put it in the oh, hold if yeah. you want. Yeah. Wow. Holy smokes. That's a big it's a big one, mate. It's very impressive. I've never caught one that big. <laughs> I guess I did catch a little fish. Yeah. Yeah, well we missed a couple other big ones. Probably missed our Spanish, that. but this thing this is a monster. Holy smokes. That okay, yeah. well we'll put him out of his misery first and then we'll and then we'll get a couple of pickies, mate, because this is this is a cracker fish. The rest of him there? Yeah. Alright. Um what we might do. Give me your hands. Yeah, what we might do. I can't carry this. Yeah, what we might do is we get you like, hold it. Put your hand under here. Alright. Let's get this guy on the cool. Oh. There we go. That is an esky filler, that's for sure. Okay, you cool with if we let the goat fish go? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Yeah, we're keeping that spangled emperor. No, the other fish, the small ones too. Yeah, well any of the dead ones. We can use those as troll baits. Alright buddy. See you later, good luck. A few more of you too. Come on. No. Come on, I'm trying to let you go, man. There you go. There you go, bud. Look how bright red they are, they're so good. See you later, man. All right, thirsty mate. This little fella's feeling a bit, uh, just been bobbing up and down for a bit, so we might. I think we've got a pretty good fish in there, mate. I don't think it yet. <laughs> you all right? You're feeling a bit crook. Yeah. All right, yeah, we've got a pretty good fish in there. We let the goatfish go, which is cool. Uh, so we'll do that another time, but that's a cracking spangled emperor. Like, that's I've never caught one that big, Fox. So that's at least got to make you happy. We missed the Spanish hits, but um, yeah, no, nah, I reckon uh, we're fine with that. Anyway, maybe we'll just wrap it up here because uh, all my cameras are cutting out anyway, and uh, we'll just head in and maybe we'll cook up some of that, uh, some of that spangled.
Oh. Someone locked him off the hook. That makes it easy. Just grab it like that. It's a pity though, because now it's all curved. I might have to try and bend it back a bit. Okay. That is a very big Spangled Emperor. They grow to probably about 90 centimetres. So this guy, we I did put a tape measure on him and he came in at 81. So that's pretty that's a pretty good one. They don't get that much bigger. Feel it. <laughs> uh, we'll come in with the cleanup crew because uh, that's all ribs. That's definitely all ribs there, but there's definitely some meat I was missing there as well. So we'll get that out. Might even make a little sashimi platter. Look at that. We have a bit of a bump there. It's hard to get into, but if you go in on an angle, you can look at those two chunks there. Beautiful. Maybe, I think maybe, maybe, I know Fox likes smoked meat, maybe we should get these on the smoker. That might be the way to do it. Look at that, that's a pretty big play of fish. Heaps of yield. And we've put the bones and everything out of the, into the fridge again, because the flies are gone crazy here which is pretty gross see how this works the cat has become increasingly uh, fussy about not eating anything he's getting mat tuna which is actually ridiculous yeah buddy Ray try that I just literally woke him up for this <laughs> you gonna try buddy <laughs> you spoiled cat. <laughs> anyway, oh no, look, he's gonna, he's gonna come back. Look, he's coming back. He's doing it. He's doing it. Don't distract him. <laughs> Fussy. Nice. Do a little sharpen. Yeah. I need to buy bulk jalapenos. I've been using so many. Pip rod. No, oh, no doubt I'll get it. Yeah. They're cooking. Well, we're going to do the panko crumbs that you requested. <laughs> what? We've changed our smoking yeah, plan. Ah, uh, well, we'll just let's just. Get it prepped up here. No, no, we're gonna get out of the beach. We'll cook it in the fry pan. But what we need to do first is get this sussed. You know what I need, buddy? Do you want to go get two eggs? Yeah. Yeah, that'll be a super good. And another dog? Uh. Oh no. No, no, I got it. I got it. Try not to get all shell in. Oh, you got a bit of shell in here. That's all right. That's all right. Oh, dear, you made a mess. Anyway. Oh, I'm gonna stuff it up too. 
Oh, you know what we need now? Spoon. Fork. Fork. Okay. Now do the finger. That's nice. Perfect. Perfect fingers. Is that good? Uh, yeah, but when uh, I flick it over, I like to give it a bit of, of a it. bit of a press down, so it sort of really embeds on it. That one's okay. Um, cool. Is that two pieces? Is that one piece or two pieces? So we're getting Fox to do all this because he's the one that caught it. So he needs to enjoy and find the joy of uh, feeding everyone with a pretty special fish. Sweet. Oh. Perfect. No, that's right. It's all right. We got it. There. Just seeing the floods anyway, I can see it. Yeah. Oh. Do you want to, you can finish that one. Oh, so you finish that one off. Beautiful. Good job. Do you want to wash your hands? Yeah. It always looks so nice on this side. Looking back over towards like the sunset. Yeah, Bitten before we panic. Well, let's panic now. Do, uh, do you want to grab that edge grab there, Dash, instead of just watching me struggle? Well, we're trying to. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I thought I might, but turns out I definitely didn't after the second try. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> nice. So we're going to have a little fish. I like your contour monster. Well, I hope you do. Go for it. Oh. <laughs> Good luck. Look at that. That's what do they call those? Um, yeah, it's a particularly nice yeah. smell. Do you want one, Mum? Sure. I am happy you've got the Soda Stream back in action. To be honest. Yeah. Here comes the tester. Oh. Just about ready. Can you take the lid off that? Yeah. And then I might put this on there because I forgot the chopping board. Yeah, just there. Yeah. Mommy. Mommy. Probably enough. Well, I think they must be getting like little insects and that because they're like. Yeah. It's not a lot. I love this. You got heaps more too. We got a strip of avocado then down the center. Oh, it's the other sauce. Yeah. What other sauce? Oh, we got the green dragon. Yeah, that's Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. We've kept it simple for Yeah, I got you, Nana. Beautiful. But definitely that Trader oh. Joe's sauce. You eat over that because that's definitely going to squid out of it. Did you get some of the salsa? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't go down in that. Oh, you got to go the pineapple salsa, man. Mm -hmm. Dash is going to go. Got a lot of good. Swing me the Trader Joe's. Yeah, Lee. Oh, you to, oh, you're going to Trader Joe it as well. Yeah, absolutely. A little bit. Can it's we stop calling it Trader Joe's? What is it? The Green Dragon. That's it. That's worse though. Yeah. Isn't it? This is yeah, we'll call it the sauce. Oh, you know what I've got? Yum. Actually, I brought something in particular. Oh I bought. No, no. I brought. So hey, this is a uh, dude. This, it could be way too hot for you, though, bro. Oh, so we're gonna try it. Craig, yeah. uh, Craig's a fan uh, of the channel or a follower of the channel. Not a fan. So that's yeah, that's silly. But Craig uh, has um, dropped off some hot sauce, and he saw basically what happened is we had um, we had uh, so funny, some hot sauce from. Uh, there were habanero hot sauce that from Freddy in the US and I was lucky enough for him to give me a bottle But then Craig saw that and he's from Australia and he was like, oh, I make a good hot sauce, too So he's dropped off Craig's hot sauce and as you can see this sauce is as hot as Craig 
So How hot we're is pretty it? well. We're going to find out. But um, yeah. let's open that up and we'll try some on, on a taco. It could be super hot. I'm not no. sure if he was just playing it down, no, it hot. or whether yeah, it's well, actually well, really well, hot. Well, but well, big well, thanks well, to Craig well, for dropping well, this off. Well, Very much well, looking well, forward to trying well, it. Well, Maybe try a bit on your hand first, because. Have one tiny bit. Let's try it. Let's try it. I love it. It might not be. Habanero and I are not best friends. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It's got a, it's got a hot look about it, Dashy. Let's... Oh, it's not coming out. Here, you might need to grab it yourself. Oh, okay. I've just tried a little bit, and it is pretty hot. Yeah, go easy. I've got a feeling it's really hot. It's still growing on me. Mm. It's hot, but it's not ridiculous hot. It's nice. What do you reckon? <laughs> it's, pretty hot. It's a bit. <laughs> so don't go too heavy on it. You don't bit, want to spoil it. Hot. Foxy, mm -hmm. you are. A little uh, bit of trouble. I didn't really taste it because yeah. I only got tiny bit. All right. Well, you just enjoy tacos, but I, I'll put a little bit on. Okay, that's good. That's good. But um, big thing, big thanks, Craig. No, it's wearing off now though, so it's not like one of those ones where you, it just makes everything Where's inedible. Something? I guess I'm kind of. We're running out of light. So, what do you reckon, Twan? Good. <laughs> so good. Then what do you I reckon, Fox? Oh, Foxy. Good. Definitely good. Yeah, we'll have a big bite. Ooh. What do you reckon, Spangled thanks Emperor? Thanks for the fish, Fox. Yeah, thanks to the fish, Foxy. Absolutely very, very good catch. Boxy. Possibly the biggest spangled emperor you'll ever catch in your life. Now, Dash is going to do the hot sauce. <laughs> Sorry, it's bad. Just Thanks, filming Craig. me. It's as hot as Craig. It's as hot as Craig. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Thanks, Craig. And thanks for watching this one. I'll see you on the next one. We're just going to enjoy dinner. We're pretty much out of light, but um, yeah. Thank you. And see you on the next one. Bye.